all you awesomely blossomly people out there welcome back to my channel my name is Nirupama and I hope you all are doing great in today's video we'll be talking about group discussion group discussion is a group of individuals come together to talk or discuss about a particular topic in which they come up with new ideas resolve problems it could be formal or informal you go for any cabin crew interview for any airline one has to go through this round this is one of the most important rounds and it tells a lot about candidates personality so in this video, I will be giving you five tips which you need to keep in mind when you appear for this round. Point number one is eye contact. It is very important and it shows your confidence. So make sure whenever you're talking to someone or someone is talking to you, you maintain the eye contact. Point number two is respect others' opinion. Now when you're in a group of people discussing about a topic, there will be difference in opinion and that's okay. We all are individuals with different thinking, mindset and mentality. Now if someone doesn't agree to what you say, you can try and make the person understand politely and if then also he or she doesn't agree to what you say, it's okay. Remember, it's not a debate or parliament, it's a cabin crew interview. So it's not about who wins, but who is well behaved and handles the situation calmly. Point number three, be calculated. Be calculated when you speak. Make sure you should not be the only person who's talking or shouldn't be the quiet one. Speak when it's required, otherwise it might leave an impression on the interviewer that you are over smart or if you'll be quiet, he might think that you know you are clueless, has no idea what's going around. So always think, analyze and then speak. Point number four is good listener. It is very important to be a good listener, especially in this job. So it is very important for you to listen carefully and never ever ever interrupt when someone is talking. It's a bad habit. Imagine yourself in that situation. For example, if you're talking and somebody interrupted in between, will you like it? No. So give the person platform to speak. Let him finish. If you have something to add on and you, you think that it's valuable and should be said in then and there, so then you can seek for permission. Like, if you don't mind, may I say something? Or, sorry to interrupt, I would like to add on something. Something like that. Point number five is have basic knowledge. Now you can only talk about something when you have some knowledge about it, right? Like human nature, that how a person will react if he's angry or upset about something. How to handle that situation? So for that, you should have some idea about human nature. Also, you can watch documentaries or case history. It will tell you a lot about this job. Like it looks glamorous and to some extent it is a glamorous job. But this is a serious business. Our primary duty is to take care of passenger safety that's what we are here for i would like to share my experience like when i went for my interview so what topic was given to me so we were a group of six people so they gave us the situation that you work in a hotel now there is one guest who's really upset because his room is not ready and it's not your fault it's your colleague's fault and he's shouting at you now what will you do how will you handle the situation so now he's upset, so I will first of all, you will offer a glass of water so the mouth will be dry. If he wants to shout at you, let him shout, let him finish, let him vent it out and then apologize. Once you apologize to the guest, you will offer him the alternative, like you know, the other room. If he doesn't agree with that, if he says that I need the same room that I had booked, then you will, so you will politely ask him to wait as the room is not ready yet. Now in this situation, what can happen that you will be like, मेरी तो गलती नहीं है तो मैं क्यों किसी की बात सुनूं ये तो मेरी कली की गलती है तो आप ये भी कर सकते हो कि यू नो आप जाके बोलो उस गेस्ट को कि यू नो सर दिस इज़ नॉट माय फॉल्ट इट्स माय कलीग्स फॉल्ट सो डोंट शॉट एट मी बट यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट देयर इन दैट यूनिफॉर्म यू आर रिप्रेजेंटिंग योर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो फॉर दैट गेस्ट इट्स नॉट यू और हरीश और राजेश और सुनीता बट इट्स यू द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन so you are representing it. So if there is a problem, there is issue, hai, he will come and speak to you. And if he is angry, he will take it out of you. Nikalega. So you don't have to take it personally. So what should be your course of action? Try to resolve the problem and offer him the alternative. Now, once that is done, everything is sorted. You have 
रिजॉल्व कर दिया है यू विल गो एंड यू विल इन्फॉर्म योर कलीग एज वेल अबाउट द इंसिडेंट बिकॉज इट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर हिम टू नो अबाउट इट बिकॉज उसकी गलती है तो अगर जान बुझ के भी नहीं किया है सो एटलीस्ट ही विल हैव एन आइडिया दैट समथिंग लाइक दैट हैपन एंड नेक्स्ट टाइम ही विल बी मोर केयरफुल अबाउट इट सो दैट यू नीड टू डू डोंट गो एंड स्टार्ट फाइटिंग विद योर कलीग कि यू नो तुम्हारी वजह से मुझे देखो इतनी डांट पड़ गई है और मेरी तो गलती थी नहीं बिकॉज दैट इज़ नॉट रिक्वायर्ड कोई भी जान बूझ के गलती नहीं करेगा एंड स्पेशली वेन इट्स अबाउट योर जॉब इंटेंशनली नो बडी डज इट सो गिव दैम द बेनिफिट ऑफ डाउट and inform them keep them in loop also remember to cross check with the guest that if he is okay or if he man person room mila ki nahi mila is he still upset if anything else you can do to make his stay comfortable so that was my answer hope you find this video helpful and if you do make sure to like share and subscribe and press the bell icon next to the subscribe button so that you will be notified whenever i'll be uploading next video also if you have any suggestion please mention it in the comment section below also not to forget to follow me on my instagram account i will be leaving the link in the description box below and yeah that's all for now i hope to see you until next time take care so you <gasps>